Welcome to 4533 Cockerham Drive here in Los Feliz. Los Feliz is one of my favorite areas that Los Angeles has to offer. This home is unbelievable. Listed at $35 million, it is 20,000 square feet and it's nine bedrooms and 11 bathrooms and it's on its own two acres plus. It has been masterfully recreated by William Hefner, AIA, who is one of the world's greatest architects living today. We're gonna to go on a journey, and it's a spectacular journey, at 4533 Cockerham Drive, right now. We start the journey of exploring this palatial home by entering this rather grand formal staircase that is clad in limestone. Next, I am met with this impressive entry, which is a custom handmade door wrapped in brushed brass, which leads me into the grand foyer. Simply a breathtaking experience. One of the finest entrances of any home I've had the pleasure to tour. I particularly love the black and white marble harlequin pattern that is so reminiscent to fine properties back in Europe. Just across from the Grand Foyer is this reception salon. A wonderful way to welcome guests into the home for a night of entertainment. I love the light in this room and how it dances off the intricate plaster work in the ceiling. Just beyond is the outdoor dining on the exceptionally large private terrace, which then traverses into an outdoor living room. The terrace is opulent, with jaw-dropping views to boot. One of the most incredible things about this property that is leaping out to me immediately is of course these explosive views on two plus acres right here in Los Feliz but it's also the detail. The phenomenal architecture that William Hefner has done, all of the surfaces, all of the materials are absolutely top notch. I haven't seen anything yet that I would turn my nose up, in fact, quite the contrary. I'm finding the whole experience quite breathtaking. So without further ado, let's continue through the rest of the house. As we leave the oversized private terrace, we pass one more time through the outdoor living room which leads us into the formal living room. Exquisitely designed with the same motif in the ceiling as the reception salon. But this room is framed by this classic hand-carved marble fireplace, which I suspect may be one of the very original fireplaces that came with the home. This completes a rather special ensemble of four spaces at the south end of the home. We now cross the grand foyer one more time and enter a wonderland of a formal dining room. This is an exceptionally special room. The walls are clad with a designer wallpaper. It's a very special place which is once again framed by this original fireplace that has been restored to its former glory. Rounding out the dining room is this rather special moment where one can unwind after a fabulous meal. As we leave the fabulous formal dining room, we now enter the heart of the home. One of the most important areas of any property, especially a luxury property, is the kitchen. I love a kitchen that is incredibly social. Now, apart from the fact that this kitchen is extremely luxurious with every kind of amenity and all the appliances are top, top, top of the line. What I want you to experience is this, the volume. It's huge. The kitchen is set to a scale that I rarely see, yet still delicate and elegant, but above all else functional 
top of the line cabinetry. And of course, fridge and freezer either side of the imported Italian range. The countertops are one of my personal favorites, Calcutta gold marble finished out by a brushed brass faucet. Framing the kitchen is additional storage with handmade custom cabinetry and additional counter space. In a home of this size, there is an additional preparation kitchen where staff can prepare a feast for gatherings and events that would be held at this magnificent home. We cross back through the kitchen into one of my favorite areas of the entire home, the family room. I love how the family room cascades back into the kitchen, making it the perfect spot for family gatherings. I love a kitchen that kind of traverses into a family room. And this is where I would sit, watching my kids, watching my dogs, just enjoying every detail, the colors, the finishes, the materials, the beautiful herringbone wooden floor. Everything here is a 10 out of 10. As we leave the heart of the home, we pass through these custom steel casement doors, which are exquisite, which connects us to a rather sweet private rear patio. I imagine the stories would go deep into the night and many glasses would be raised whilst the children and dogs play on the grass late into the evening. Just adjacent to the rear terrace is this commercial grade outdoor kitchen, complete with yet another magnificent stone and an oversized barbecue. Preparation surfaces, outdoor sink and refrigerators complete the ensemble. Our journey now continues on the second level of this magnificent palatial estate. There is a recapitulation on the upper level of the black and white marble flooring, which for me is exquisite. The details in this home are second to none, and we experience yet another phenomenal area of design as we now enter the owner's suite. Once again, it is the volume. This room is vast and it faces south, so the light dancing off of the walls and all of the accoutrement is simply divine. The herringbone hand-laid oak floors work perfectly in this room that's framed by yet another vintage marble fireplace. The light is cascading in from the south as I walk back through the master bedroom one more time. And adjacent to the bedroom is a private full-sized sitting room reserved only for the owner's suite. This to me is the epitome of class. There is nothing more desirable than walking through your private sitting room onto an enormous private terrace reserved only for the owner's suite with sweeping vistas from the west all the way across Los Angeles to the east. This is a very special moment. The journey continues as we enter the first of two full bathroom suites attached to the master bedroom. This first one has more masculine tones. I love the black marble with the white edging, which leads us to the first of two full closets this one is finished in wonderful cherry wood. We then transition into the second attached full bathroom. This one has much more feminine tones with a wonderful motif of pink onyx. The white marble floors have hand laid pink onyx flowers throughout. This then leads us into a closet 
that I will label as epic. This is a dream closet. And one that has more than enough room for the most complicated wardrobe. Next, we continue to the auxiliary bedrooms. No expense has been spared and each one of the separate bedrooms, all en suite, have been meticulously designed. The black and white marble motif recapitulates once more in a wonderful fashion. Each bedroom having the herringbone hand laid oak floors and each one remarkably different. Very often in a home of this size, we can begin to see bedrooms feel very similar, but that's not the case with Cockerham. Each room has a unique design and a unique flavor, such as this one, which has an interconnecting patio, which would be perfect for families that are staying at the property. Mom and dad in one bedroom, whilst the kids are in another, but they're all still connected. It's now time to experience the lower level of this magnificent property, which is devoted to entertainment, well-being and health. As I go down one last white marble staircase, it brings me into a full bar, finished with the most divine green marble and oak cabinetry one more time, which is of course adjacent to a cinema. As many of you know, this is my absolute dream to have a full cinema in my home. Um, we often see cinemas or screening rooms in luxury properties, but by nature, some of them are quite small and pokey. This one has some width. It feels very grand. The screen is much bigger than most of the screening rooms we go in, and you could easily sit 10, 12, 16 people in here. This is a sensational screening room, and it's gonna be one that I hold in my heart. When I build my house and put one in it, I'm gonna make it look just like this one. Adjacent to the bar is of course a lounge where one can enjoy a nice cocktail or even a cigar. The home even comes with a full-size billiard table and ping pong set, which is a rather nice touch. We continue the journey into a rather epic oversized gym. This is a remarkable space and could be filled with the most professional equipment that any owner could ever want. Naturally, the home is equipped with a full dry sauna and wet sauna. After a full workout, the piste de la resistance would be to step outside and take a dip into this extraordinary hot tub with magnificent view of downtown Los Angeles. Yes, once again, this is another very special moment. We have completed our tour of the main residence and now we're going to explore the private gardens the pool deck and the pool house. The journey to the pool deck begins by entering through these fabulous traditional wrought iron black gates. I then wander up a short path and experience several different moments and flavors of botanical gardens. Just a few more steps and I'm at the pool. We must have a pool deck. And this is a magnificent pool deck located at the rear of the property, so lovely and private. One of the reasons that a pool is located here is so that we can get this epic view all the way across Los Angeles. It frames downtown absolutely perfectly. And this is a beautiful moment to just chill, enjoy the fountains, enjoy the view, and frankly, enjoy life. Our very last stop on the tour is the pool house. Remarkably large in size, easily this could accommodate multiple guests. The pool house comes equipped with a kitchen 
that could rival many luxury properties with all the accoutrements one could desire. The original River Rock fireplace is left intact. I find this an adorable feature which is mirrored in the bedroom. The bedroom itself is again oversized and more than comfortable. Whether it be a short-term guest or a long-term guest, this would be a wonderful space. Well, that's about it. Thank you so much for being with me on this magnificent tour of 4533 Cockerham Drive right here, nestled in the hills of Los Feliz. I have to say, this is one of the most exquisite homes that I have had the pleasure to tour. Um, don't forget to subscribe and give me a thumbs up and I will look forward to seeing you all again on the next one. Until then, this is Pete Lorimer, signing out. Toodaloo.